Well, this will be a talker tomorrow. Do, yeah. you, do you ever think you could get emails from the dead? A Pennsylvania man says he did, and he's convinced it's not spam. CBS 21's Eva Roman is live with the Cumberland County Mobile Newsroom in Hamden Township. Eva, this is just an amazing story. What does this guy say happened? It's kind of spooky, you guys. The BBC interviewed a man who says that several months after his close friend died, he received an email from him from beyond the grave. He says the email had personal information that only they knew about. Tim Art's childhood friend died in June of last year. Five months later, Art checked his email and there it was, a message from his deceased friend talking about cleaning his attic. The subject heading, I'm watching. Oh, well that's kind of scary and somewhat perplexing. One of my distant ancestors, he was a general, died at uh, Gettysburg back in the Civil War, they say his ghost appears, the tour guides and whatnot, but never seen one. But <laughs> never in an email? No, never in an, in an email. Some people CBS 21 News spoke to about this believe that it could be spam or someone who hacked into the account, which has been known to happen. My mother's actually received something like that, and they found that the email account was hacked. My first thought is that somebody probably set up a fake email address. The source of Tim Art's emails remain a mystery. Now, if you'd like to intentionally send out emails after you die, there is an actual website for that. It's called the Dead Man's Switch. We're live with the Cumberland County Mobile Newsroom tonight in Hamden Township. Eva Roman, CBS 21 News.